there's lots of mixing between Argentina and Paraguay, but they both are a little bit distinct. So the Paraguay food is um, more chicken, um, we ate a lot of fried milanesa, which is like, it's chicken or meat that's um, breaded and then fried. And there I also ate cow heart, which was exciting. And I also ate mondongo, which you should look up. That's pretty exciting food to eat too. It was not very good, but some people like it. Um, they also have this thing that they make called the tortilla, which is like Indian fry bread. If you've ever had that, it's really yummy. Um, we ate a lot of rice. Um, we ate asado, which is basically like a barbecue, not like with hamburgers, but with like real meat. It's good. It's way good. And then ensalada de fruta, which is every kind of fruit you can name in like a soup and it's really sweet and really good and one of my favorite things ever to eat. They also have alfajores, which are little chocolate dipped cakes, cookie things with dulce de leche, which is like caramel inside. So they're really yummy. Um, in Argentina, you have more of the Italian influence where I was. So they had like cannolis and gnocchi and lots of pasta. Um, also the meat in Argentina is amazing. I loved it. Um, they don't eat very many vegetables in my mission, like almost no vegetables. And they pour oil on everything, which is really great. Um, there's one thing in Paraguay that's called bori bori, which is like a soup um, made with cornmeal balls and then like meat in it. It's, it's pretty good. Um, but really it depends on who's cooking because any meal can be really great or not so great depending on who makes it. The other thing that's traditional from there is called chipa which is like a donut, but instead of being a donut, it tastes like a Cheez-It because it has cheese in it. And it's really good. And I can't describe it, but it's so good. In Argentina, they have choripan, which is like a hot dog, but they use French bread, and then they put like this giant sausage in it that they cook over a grill, and it's so good. It's amazing. And then they put this sauce on it called chimichurri, which is like spicy vegetables, and it's wicked. Um, so the other thing you should know about Argentina is that they have the siesta, which is basically everyone eats a huge lunch, and then after lunch they go to bed and sleep for like three or four hours, and then everyone gets back up and goes back to their regular jobs and regular life regular life. So lunch is a big deal. Like that is the dinner of Argentina. And then when we would eat dinner, they eat dinner at like nine or maybe 10, but lunch is the big meal. So in our mission, we had breakfast and then a lunch hour, but no dinner hour, which isn't that big a deal. I usually just carried like a banana or an orange in my backpack and it worked out fine. And then when you get back home, you can eat whatever you want. But yeah, that's lunch. <laughs> so I was a somewhat picky eater before the mission, but now I'll eat literally anything that you give me. I hated bananas and I hated eggs. And now I love bananas and I love eggs. I don't know why, but the, ban the bananas and the, all the fruit in general are so good in South America. I love them. Um, but yeah, I think just Eating the food there just made me get over my picky eaterness. It was great.